Hello, hello. What's up, techies? Finally, there is some relief for all those asking us about the 5G network. After Jio, Airtel has confirmed that it has been working on the technology. But as we all know, everything depends on the proper infrastructure. Anyway, you're watching India Today Tech. I am Pavni Jain, and this is our latest Q&A hashtag Let's Get Techy video. For all those who are new to our channel, this is how it works. You just put your question in the comments, use the hashtag Let's Get Techy, and we'll pick your question in the next week's video. Without further ado, let's begin with the questions. Question number one is from Sumit Tulsiyan, and it is. Hi, can you please advise the cheapest over-the-ear headphone, which offers a mute option? Um, I'm assuming that you're looking for a headset for a gaming or video calls. A cloud core headset, which is priced at rupees six thousand four hundred and nineteen in India, comes with a USB remote that has a slider to mute the microphone. You can also use the same to uh, adjust the volume levels, and it also has a detachable microphone. For better audio input, Ajay Deedal writes, "When will Realme X7 series come in India? I'm waiting for last three and a half months. Please leak launch date. Uh, the Realme X7 series will launch on February 4th. We will probably have two smartphones: uh, one Realme X7 and another one is Realme X7 Pro. Both of these smartphones have already been launched in China sometime in September 2020." and now we will finally have them in india so ajay your wait is going to get over very soon aron jude has a question can you suggest a laptop under rupees 60000 that can be used for a data science student with deep learning syllabus um you can go for dell inspiron 14 which comes with a 10th generation intel core i5 processor and also with 8 gb of ram and 512 gb ssd the laptop comes with fairly decent screen as well it has got 15 inch full hd display and it can last up to 8 hours you also get several connectivity options with this laptop gogula writes which is the best smart band around rupees 3000 3000 you can get a good fitness band for even less than that the two you should check out are mi band 5 and honor band 5 both of these feature uh, amoled displays and cover all the basics the best part is you can get both of these smart bands for less than 2500 rupees next question is from ram and he writes hi pavni hey ram kindly suggest a wired type c headset under rupees 1500 to 2000 kindly note that i already have a wireless one uh then you can buy a pair of vision shift jp55p uh i'll mention the name here from amazon for rupees 700 actually there are not a lot of options when it comes to type c wired headphones or earphones so if you're not sure about vision shift then what i suggest is Uh, you go and buy an extra 3.5 mm to type c cable and look for better earphones from brands like sony or jbl or others sangeet right what about oneplus 9 realme x7 rog5 iq5 or 7 samsung s21 fe okay let's take it one by one uh, oneplus 9 will launch sometime in mid march Realme X7 is arriving on February 4. ROG 5, the launch date is yet to be announced. IQ 5 or 7. IQ 5 didn't release in India, but we might have IQ 7 coming in March. Samsung S21 FE. What? Next question. Mahi Vardhan Singh Rathod writes, best laptop under rupees 1 lakh for normal office use with more battery backup. Uh, you should definitely go for MacBook Air with M1 chip. Apple claims to offer 15 hours of web usage with the new MacBook, which is uh, more than enough to get you through the long day at work. He also writes best laser printer under rupees 8000. Uh, check out HP DeskJet 2621. It is an all-in-one printer and is also compatible with smart HP app. The printer also works with uh, Alexa and Google for voice commands. 
you can grab this at around rupee 6400 so that's all for this week's video now you know the drill if you like this video give it a big fat thumbs up share this video with your friends and subscribe to india today tech i'll see you in the next one